Ben here from Mary Public Library. I have to say thank you to Rachel, one of our viewers, who sent this book to me and asked me to review it. So I very much enjoyed reading this book. But before I get into the book, I have to explain to you what makes this book so unique, so popular. It's called the Pappy Effect. See, the bourbon boom happened. We've taken it all for granted. But before that, bourbon was almost dead. But because of the bur because of Pappy, bourbon is now white hot. It used to be that you could go to one of the distilleries on the bourbon trail, just show up, pay $5 and do the tour. Because of the Pappy effect, now you have to plan months in advance and you have to spend the price of a good bottle of bourbon just to get admission into these distilleries. It's again, because of the popularity of Pappy. Pappy is kind of like unicorn blood. There you go, Gary, there's your literary connection. Very rare very hard to find but as I'm reading this book I've got all these expectations that I'm going to learn about Pappy and all the struggles that he went through to make it what it is today and I was kind of like blown away because it's not what I expected at all and I get to reading a story of family fine bourbon and things that last Pappy Land again this is a book about family Pap Pappy Van Winkle uh, started in 1935 and it just touches on the struggles that they went through. The only real bit of scholarship is when the author talks about um, racehorses. There's, again, there's a little segue, bourbon and racehorses do go together, but it, it, there's just some light nuggets in this that, you know, that do make this book worth a read. It's a great read. I was kind of blown away when the guy said that, uh, believe it or not, tasting high-end bourbon is tiring. I want that problem, really. But anyway, uh, it was a great read. Rachel, thank you very much for sending this book to me. Um, we do have this at the Marion Public Library, and if you like bourbon <laughs> and you like reading, this is a marriage of two great things. Thanks.